with each of the classes that you do, do it with post-it notes rather than, so a lot of students, what they'll do is they'll hard write the actual classes in with pen. What that does is it's like the moment you write it in with pen, it's hard to like take that thing off and move it to another quarter, right? Hmm. Um, and so like, I, I can send you this uh, via text. I'll send you a link to it. Um, I tried to, um, I think I tried to, yeah, I tried to describe it. I said, your plan must be flexible, easy to edit, visually appealing, easy to print and accurate. And so the way that I described that in the, in the lecture was to do it with post-it notes, just so that when, you know, let's say that you like right now, right? So you just change, if you're about to change 22 AL, imagine you had like handwritten that, right? Mm -hmm. Now you have to go in, like erase that thing, write it in a different space. But if every single class that you have is a single post-it note and you want to change 22 AL, you just take that post-it note off of spring 2020, move it to fall 2020. Oh, actually, I think you've actually worked on this with me. I have one of like, planned of like when I was planning to go to Davis when I was planning to graduate and then start my like graduate degree oh great um, but now I think about all my post-its are in the wrong place <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're not in the wrong place they're just they, they're in a place previously that they weren't now right <laughs> yeah there's the benefits of post-it notes like you literally just like take them off and move them and it's super easy yeah. right 